smoothness and balance vibrations. I trust your well and vibe and resonance. I'm the reflection of you, Curtis Hebrew. And we still got stuff to do. <laughs> On an everyday basis, we have you know, uh, a list of things that we want to get done, things that we need to get done, and things that we hope to get done uh, in, in light of you know, becoming the best versions of ourselves. And some stuff just needs to be done. <laughs> so, uh, I'm actually got it. I was inspired by a brother of mine, uh, Roman Nick Cole, my 17, uh, from, uh, from college. Amazing brother. Uh, much love to you, bro. I told you I'd do it, so I'm doing it now. And it's just taking time to say thank you. Show a grad, show gratitation, <laughs> gratitude, uh, gratitude for those you see. Uh, just doing positive things, you know, for you or just for the community. And I just wanted to say. I'm honored to know you, my bro, and I appreciate you for being humble and, and being the reflection of uh, humility. Is that a word? Humility? <laughs> of just being grateful, man. So uh, I'm grateful for, I, I really can't call out specific names that I'll be calling out for until tomorrow, the day before, and after that. So I just kind of say like groups. So I'm honored for, uh, grateful for those who are putting their work for their community, uh, even if the light is not shining on you. You know, you still do what needs to be done because you know it needs to be done. You know, for those uh, working hard uh, at their daily job, going above and beyond, even though their check doesn't result or prove that you are going above and beyond. I've been in those places, those places where you, know, you work extra hours, extra days, extra moments, and it's not for the extra pay, it's for uh, your students or your, your customers, um, your clients, uh, your children, your youth. You know, I appreciate all those who are doing that amazing work that only can be, only harvest that can be benefited from is the, the full progression of those you're serving. You know, them coming back and say, oh, you did it for me. You were that person that gave me the extra hand, that who sat down and talked with me, who got me through this particular moment that I thought I couldn't go any further. So I honor you. I gotta thank my supreme brother Savon Beaumont for being uh, a trailblazer in the conscious community, as in, you know, creating the stuff that's applicable um, to to digest um, mentally, physically, and spiritually. Creating networks, creating uh, open space, open source spirituality on SecretEnergy.com, uh, where you know it's a hub for for consciousness awareness. Uh, where well, we said we activate humans. Uh, I also got to give another shout out to all the beautiful people in the tribe who are who share the knowledge. You know that because it's not because it takes a special person to get jewels and, and massive uploads and um, ground shattering, a foundation shattering information that completely changes the way we perceive reality and being able to transmute that into their own words, into their own blogs, into their own videos, their own posts and share with their circle, their network. That takes brave, bravery, uh, integrity and so much to, to really just share that information because you know you're looked at as you know a black sheep most time in your family because you say oh I don't want to eat uh, cheese anymore or I don't want to eat meat anymore or I don't believe in this concept of uh, of religion anymore and being brave enough to actually speak that truth and stand on it you know major shout out to you and everything that you you stand for um, I also want to give a shout out to uh, my queen I have, have a supreme shout out my firstborn is here so I definitely got to give a major shout out to to her the superwoman who has uh, given me my first son so uh, we asked him to keep him off of social media so for all the family, you probably already know. If not, just come by the house. Uh, also, got to give a major shout out to just my light workers out here, just sharing love, sharing light, doing what needs to be done because we know it needs to be done. You, you know that you are the superhero, the hero, the the the, the, the cosmic achiever to take this world to the next level. You know, and anytime you take that opportunity to share with others or share with yourself. Know it's reflected anywhere as it's imploding 
um, creating more opportunities for you to give and have that abundance to share with those you love and all those who have ears to, ear, ears to hear and eyes to see. So keep vibing and resonance at top speeds. This is my love to you. Much, much gratitude to the earth, to the sun and beyond. Holding and balanced vibrations. Top speed. And the reason why we know we need to collect and we need to gather now in this unity is because there are real things happening in the world and we're sort of getting punch drunk with all the news and the Illuminati and the troubles and because we've rested our foundation on this platform that we're calling Earth and we have our children here, it could become a permanent anxiety for us to go through every single day if, if we're in our right and left minds, meaning balanced and really thinking about what exactly is happening in the reality and how that's gonna affect us. So anybody that is paying attention will feel a bit nervous in this reality that we're living in right now if the foundation that they're standing on isn't solid. And we believe that the foundation, you know, despite all of our crown chakra ideals, the foundation rests in the root chakra, it rests in the feet, it rests in the streets, it rests in the hood, it rests in the dirt. It rests where all of what we're standing on right is. in front of you and we're asking for your support to take a quantum solution to the next stage and really develop an entirely different way of how we all connect.